Okay, so in this video, I'll show you how to use this computational tree to design a multi-tape deterministic machine that reflects um, the non-deterministic Turing machine. So in this case, we need to show for every iteration um, that the deterministic machine would take to simulate this type of a uh, tracing. So what we would be doing is that we would be designing a deterministic Turing machine that has a control system but also has a number of tapes. So in the first tape you would have the uh, input. So it would be A, C, A, B. So that would be uh, your uh, representation and then it, you would start doing um, the uh, tracing. So at the beginning uh, you would need to uh, start with the uh, addressing um, so that you can uh, go through each one of the branches. So before I go further talking about this we are going to look at this and see how did we uh, create these addresses? So right now this is a parent and it has one child, so we give it the number one. Now this is a parent that has three ch children, one, two, and three. And then this parent has one child, so this one is one. And this parent has one child, so this one is one. This parent has one child, so one. And this parent has one child, so one. And so that's how you <clears throat> address uh, nodes in the tree. So now, if I want to determine the branch that I am taking to uh, start the uh, simulation, I will start with a breadth first search. So what I will be doing is I would not address the root. So I just immediately go to the uh, first um, child for this one and since it's only one child so we're going to put on the address here uh, one so basically your pointer is now here and you have a pointer here and then we are going to simulate the uh, tracing so what would happen here is that we would simulate a c a b and we would have now the pointer here. So obviously we do not have an accept uh, configuration so we need to continue uh, moving on as well. So in the next step since I did not reach an accept configuration what I am going to do is I am going to move on to the next node in the breadth first search. So because breadth first search goes um, one level at a time and then goes one, two, three, like that. So in this case, now what we need to do, we need to simulate this one. So for this one, it is actually um, one, one. So basically what we need to do is now we need to do, um, right, so this is the control. So that's what it would look like. Right, that's what the control would look like. Okay, so now we have our next one, which is now we have the address one one, and now the pointer is here, and we have A C A B, and the pointer is always here because that is the one that we um, we use to. Um, copy every single time to the simulation tape. So we're going to do the first step, which is A, C, A, B, and now the pointer is here. And then, so for this step, we have two steps. Uh, so we have here, um, this is the step for one. So here we have the step for one, and now we're going to have the second step here, which is uh, it's going to move to the second one. So now it's going to move here, right, to this one. So 
this is the uh, control system. So we have again here A, C, A, B, and always for this one, we use it to copy. And, and now here, we see that the pointer is going to move uh, right to uh, A. So it's going to be A, C, and the pointer is now at A, B, and also we have the address and now the pointer is here. So basically what this is, is this is the control system. So you would imagine it like this, right? So that's how uh, these pointers for all of these uh, tapes work. Okay, so now we still have not received um, an accept configuration. So what we will be doing now is we will be moving to, because we, we started with this one, this is on this level. Now we have this level, so we're gonna start, we started with this one. This one didn't work, so now we need to go to this one. So this is now a, uh, a new step, right? So this is one, two, that is the address of this nod. You have to go from the root to one, then two to reach this nod. So what we will be doing is that we will be repeating this step again, right? So it's going to be on this tape. We are going to have um, one and two, okay? So obviously what we could have done is that we could have written one, one, one here. So we could have written one, 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 and then one, one again, and then uh, one, two after that. Uh, but uh, for the purpose of showing uh, how we do the tracing, I would um, uh, advise you in the exam to uh, give the representation like this. Okay, so now we are at um, 1, uh, 2. So what we would be doing is that we would have, again, the same input. It's always the same, and the pointer is at the beginning because we use it to copy. Okay, so now what we are going to do for this step, we're going to have the first step, which is uh, the pointer is at 1. So we would have A, C, A, B, and the pointer is at C. So why is the pointer at C? Because you can see here in this step, the pointer is at C, right? So uh, that's why we put it there. Okay, as for uh, giving the states, you don't need to give the states um, here, okay? So this is basically what this one would look like. Now the next step uh, in this iteration, you would have also a, C, A, B is always the same. And now the next step would be uh, that the pointer is now at A. So we have A, um, C, A, B, and now the pointer is at two. So we have it like this, and now the pointer here is at A. So this is basically what it uh, looks like. Right, these that there is the uh, pointers. So now this didn't work, and uh, because we are not still at an accept configuration, so what we're going to do is that we are going to move to our next nod. So in this case, what's going to happen is that we are going to go from. Uh, so we started uh, with going from the root to all the children of the root. Now, and uh, we only have one child in the root, so that's what we did. We started with one and then that didn't work we didn't reach an accept configuration so we went to the next item in the breadth first search so it's going to be on this level now we're going to do this level so we did one one so that's what we did here and we moved from one address to another and then we did one two so we did that and then we moved to that address now what we need to do is we need to go to one three so uh, in this case it's going to also be two steps so we have the first step and then we also have the um, second step. So uh, uh, this one is always the same, A, C, A, B, and then we have A, C, A, B, and then we have one, three, and at the beginning, uh, we start with uh, one, 
and uh, one is known, so it's always at C. So you can see here that the point 